Hello everybody, Chris here, and in this Word 2016 video I'm going to show you how to write quick math equations. So as you can see here, I've already added the formula for the area of our circle out here onto the screen, and the way I did that was by going over to the Insert tab on the far right, you're going to see Equation. You can click that drop down, and you have access to a good chunk of equations here, and you can also find more online. But for most people, what you're going to want to actually be doing is writing out your own equations. So if you insert equation here, you're going to have access to all of these tools. Now, you can manually put in symbols like on the division sign. You just click that and it will add it down here. And that's not a bad way of doing things. In addition, fraction with uh, spaces for numbers as well and all the other math stuff you're going to need. But the way I like to actually uh, write out my equations is using ink equation over here on the left. It's really cool because all you need to do is uh, use the mouse and almost like it's paint, you just draw on the screen what your equation is supposed to be. You know, in the old days, it was a complete pain in the butt to get the right symbols to show up on screen. Uh, for instance, if you wanted to have a power sign, you would have had to do superscript. But here, you can just write the number in its proper space, and it's almost as easy as just writing it out on paper. Now, you can see here that uh, Word isn't perfect about it. My 2 looks like a Z to it. So we can use the Select and Correct tool on that to actually make that a 2. And now we can continue our equation. So simple algebra, maybe we do like a plus 4y here equals, and let's say 22. And maybe that'll show up as a z. It didn't. So it's not too bad at recognizing it. And once we've double checked to confirm that our equation is being put in correctly, we can just hit the insert button. And it's going to add that as uh, well, an equation box containing text into our Microsoft Word document. So of course you can get more complicated than that if you're doing integrals, uh, derivatives, calculus stuff. That's all over here on the right. But you'd be able to write that in Ink Equation as well. And that's where you add equations in Microsoft Word 2016. So I hope this tutorial was useful for you. I've been Chris. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in my future videos.